What would I say to someone who's only seen limited representation of bi plus identities? You are not alone. There are so many people in the world who identify as bi plus, and that number is growing and growing, especially amongst younger people. Um, what I would suggest that you do is seek out that representation, seek out resources, go online, um, read by community news in the UK, read by women quarterly, um, which is a worldwide publication, read, um, go on, you know, look at the different bisexual organizations that exist in various countries around the world um, and read their website, just like soak up all the resources. Um, you are so not alone, no matter what you feel. There are so many other bi plus people and we come in every size and shape and some of us are wonderful and some of us are terrible and some of us are all kinds of different things just like people of any other identity. So because of bi erasure and because of some of the problems in the media, um, a lot of people have only seen very limited representation of bisexuality in books, TV, film, etc. Um, and this can lead to a lot of misconceptions about bisexuality and I think a lot of the misconceptions it can not cause but definitely entrench include things like thinking bi people are indecisive because this is a big trope in media, uh, thinking bi people cheat more, thinking bi people are just going for a phase and that they'll eventually come out as gay or straight, um, thinking that bi people don't like to label our sexuality, uh, all these kinds of things. And so what I would say to people who've only seen very limited representation is there's a lot out there and a lot of it is made by, by people ourselves. We have been making a lot of content um, and you know you can find it on YouTube, you can find it in fan fiction, you can find it on blogs, um, in articles, in poetry. So if you have the opportunity to look for bi writers and bi creators because we know our own experiences best and also you know the bi community is not a homogenous group, we are not a monolith, there are so many bi experiences, so many different types of bi identities and it's important to explore all of those and to explore the intricacies and the niches and you know to really get your head around our community and what makes us tick and what you shouldn't say to us and what you shouldn't do and so yeah if you've only seen very limited representations of bisexuality, I highly recommend finding some bi creators and Bi Visibility Month is a great way to do that because often bi creators will be promoting their stuff in the Bi Visibility Month tag on Twitter or Instagram or wherever. Check it out, find some bi creators, follow some bi creators and I promise you'll get much better bi representation than if you just wait for streaming services or TV or whatever to bring it to you.